Okay, so I'm not always gonna be there for you like this. I can't just follow you around to reset things and hold your neural weave together. Whatever choices you make from here on out, they're your choices. But you were supposed to be my AUG expert. I specialize in Chinese black market, okay? The shit I found hidden inside you, spliced into your system like that, looks to me like it's from Mars, man! I'm pretty sure they're not from Mars. I just... I feel bad. You deserve answers I can't give you. I can help manage your system better than anyone in Prague. I help you make the most of the new Augs we just found. But you can't tell me where the hell they came from. As far as I know, David Seraph installed all my Augs. There's something inside me I don't know about. He's the one I need to talk to. I am familiar with Saris' work. These new Augs, they... They look different to me. I mean, that neodymium shell. Who uses dimorphic magnetoreological fluid like that? Seriously, if you talk to Sarif, you need to ask him that. Shit really stands out. Pretty fucking cool, actually. You ever seen anything like this before? An AUG system that's deliberately hidden like that? I don't know, Jensen. I mean, I heard of people getting the black market treatment before. Pass out in Prague, wake up in Shanghai... But usually they wake up with less augs, not more. What exactly makes these augs so different from my other ones? They look like experiments, is what. Loose wiring everywhere, man. It's like half of you is uh, untested, unfinished, unbelievable. It's... it's beautiful, is what it is. Why would Seraph have hidden these things inside me? I don't get it. I am not convinced this is a Sarif job. The tech itself is super high-end, but the PDOT insulation, sloppy. The bone mounting mounted on the quick. Just doesn't have Sarif's touch. Looks more like a retrofit to me. Something much more recent. Well, what are you thinking? I'm thinking how much I hate being unconscious. You said these additions look recent. How recent? Within the last two years, give or take. Something happened to you in that time? I was pulled out of the ocean and put in some facility in Alaska to recover. There's a few months there that... The more I try to remember, the blurrier it gets. Shit, Jensen. That's terrifying. This tune-up went longer than I expected. Let's wrap this up. Right. Here, take some Praxis kits for the trouble. Praxis solves everything. Keeps customers happy. Just, uh, remember what I showed you about managing your juice. It's gonna be a balancing act for you. Well, unless... Unless what, Kohler? There could be a way to optimize. It's just... It would involve getting something from Otar. A neuroplasticity calibrator. There's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise? I want to know about it. I was hoping you'd say that. I order all my fancy tech from this illegal catalog, right? But... My last shipment got intercepted by Otar Botkoveli. The same Otar whose men were looking for books out there before? I am not going to force you. I want you to want to do it. I want you to want to be an augmented god among men. If that sounds like something that interests you, then you should know that Otar runs an underground casino in the Chisti district. The entrance is in a small courtyard of Hlavni Street. Thanks for the info, Connor. Thanks for the praxis. Man, you know I love you, Jensen, but we both have work to do. What do you need? This calibrator you need. What is it exactly? It's a device that allows me to measure and manipulate neuronal connections. 
I mean, I can eyeball with the best of them, but for any type of advanced procedure. So you can't optimize my system without this device? An OTAR just happens to have it. I was having a shipment of tools delivered to somewhere I shouldn't have. An OTAR intercepted. I'm sorry, Jensen. This situation I got with the Diwalis, it's not really your problem. I'm starting to think it is. What else do I need to know about Otar? Otar Botkoveli is the second in command of the Diwali crime family here in Prague. People say he is a good guy to have on your side. And if you're not on his side? Then you hide behind the wall and hope Otar doesn't find you. It's frustrating, Jensen. I... I got this deal with Otar's boss, Radic Nikolazzi. Way under the table, super secret. The Diwali are supposed to stay away from me. Guess Otar didn't get the memo. Tell me more about your relationship with the Diwali. What exactly are you caught up in? Well, you see, it's... It's not so much a relationship. And not so much with the Diwalis, per se. It's more of a, um, an occasional contact with Radic Nikoladze. Alright. So this contact you happen to have with Radic, then? The problem here isn't me so much. Radic has a habit of keeping things from Otar. And Otar, he doesn't like what he doesn't know. So he puts heat on me as a way of putting heat on Radic. Trying to burrow into his secrets, you know? Does Radic have secrets buried here with you? My deal with Radic, part of this deal, is that I don't talk to anyone about my deal. Not Otar, not you, no one. No offense, Jensen, you scared the shit out of me. Otar, he scares the shit out of me. But Radic... Radic is worse than both of you put together. That's all I need for now, Doc. Yeah, yeah, okay. And hey, good luck with that shit. Don't fry yourself, all right? Jensen, it's Miller. Listen, I need your eyewitness report as soon as possible. What's your ETA? Depends on how many cops ask to see my papers. Fuck. Not much I can do about state police after yesterday's attack. Get in when you can. Miller out. Moving from current position. <laughs> No one can redeem you but yourself. Are you sure? I do not think that sounds right. Seek and claw the flesh.
Adam, thanks for calling me back, son. I heard about the bombing in Prague. It's all... I'm not interested in your sympathy, Seraph. We've got more important things to discuss. Like my doctor finding dormant augs hidden in my system. What? Dormant experimental augs. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Adam, you know the decisions I made for you two years ago. Yes or no? No! All the work we did on you was above board. You have my word on that. What, uh... What exactly did you find? Experimental test dogs spliced into my system. Kohler said something about a neodymium shell. Who would have designed something like that? God, you've got a Titan dog? It's impossible. It was just a concept. You just said this wasn't you. It wasn't. The DoD showed me schematics three years ago and asked me if I thought it could work. It was designed by somebody else, Vadim Orlov. Megan and I interviewed him once, but he wouldn't have fit in. Orlov? Sounds Russian. Who is he? Why wouldn't he have fit in? He was supposed to be a boy wonder, a neuroscience prodigy. Got his master's degree in Moscow, post-grad in the U.S. His grades were off the chart, but his theories were uh, sketchy at times. Megan said his ethics were questionable. Megan? Megan Reed said that? The woman who gave you my DNA to experiment with? We didn't hire him, Adam. Two minutes into the interview and I could tell Orloff didn't like his ideas being challenged by anyone. Least of all, a strong woman like your ex. These schematics you saw. Don't suppose you kept a copy? You were classified. I never had a copy. The only reason I even saw them was because the Defense Department valued my opinion. Seraph Industries did good work back in the day. When we signed a schematic, you knew it was solid. I've got to find this guy. Adam, let me track him down for you. I'm leaving for London soon. I've got meetings with Nathaniel Brown and the Santo Group there. But I can make phone calls, uh, reach out to people. Seraph Industries may be gone, but my name still carries weight in certain circles. Do it. Contact me by info link when you have something. I won't let you down on this. I never felt right about losing touch with you after Panchea. When I heard you'd shown up in Detroit alive a year after everyone thought you were dead, why didn't you get in touch with us? I couldn't. Rescue crews pulled me out of the ocean and dumped me in a clinic in Alaska. Nobody knew who I was. For a long time, neither did I. My god, son, you don't think... I mean, that could have been when... Find Orlov, Seraph. I've got questions I need answered. I will, I promise. I'll call you. 